Decorations for St. Patrick's Day are beginning to appear around the city. There's a new option for 2024, and it's on Staten Island on Sunday, March 17th. There may even be some that march in both parades, but we're hoping that anyone that didn't march in the original one and couldn't or couldn't march will be marching in this one. Kim Beckett is owner of the Burrito Bar and Restaurant, and she's a member of the area's Business Improvement District. The bid is sponsoring it and named it for the route along Forest Avenue in the West Brighton neighborhood of Staten Island. It is open to all groups. Last year, we were hoping that the original Staten Island Parade would be an inclusive event and that the Pride Center would be allowed to march, and they weren't. So this year, we decided, wouldn't it be great just to have another celebration? This year marks the 60th annual procession of the St. Patrick's Day Parade of Staten Island. It's described as being organized by Roman Catholic committee members, begins with the mass. They have not allowed LGBTQ organizations to participate. Business owners along Forest Avenue say two parades will be good for business. They get to give a nod to their, you know, uh, religious backgrounds on the stuff, but it's nice to also have another one where it's all inclusive. Everyone is my constituent. Sam Pirazzolo represents the area in the New York State Assembly. For, for me as a political person, it's really about inclusion, you know, not exclusion. It's about, you know, addition, not subtraction. So we'll see. It'll work itself out. The parade in Manhattan is known as the world's largest and oldest St. Patrick's Day parade. In 2014, it reversed its position and allowed people to march with the banner representing gay and lesbian organizations. That first parade will be held on March 3rd. I did check in with uh, that organization. They didn't have a comment on the addition of this second parade. They said they are proceeding uh, with their plans. That second parade held then on St. Patrick's Day itself, uh, March 17th.